Hey everyone, in today's video I'll show the steps to quilling this letter K. Part of the design was inspired by um, this picture, which after an hour of searching and sweating I finally discovered was done by Sabina Karnik. Sorry if I mispronounced that. So here is my custom K outline and for those interested it's a mix of two fonts called Bosque and Mermaid. Both of them from Defont.com and along with some tweaks of my own. And I thought I'd show a bit of my design process because although I've got my inspiration I still want to do what I think looks good and fits the space. And the way I do that is basically trial and error. I try something out, see if I like it. I don't like that. Turn it upside down. I don't like that. No. Not that either. And that's looking pretty good. Yeah. I'll we'll start gluing that in. And after all that test and retest and truth, it's pretty close to Sabina Karnick's. So now we've got the basic vine shape. You can really get going here. Although I actually, I had a really frustrating start to the leaves. And it was driving me crazy until I switched methods and I came up with this. Where I make a small loop, glue it, Then after I cut it off, I squeeze it flat, and then kapop! There's my leaf! Fun! And so much happier. And gluing in all the leaves I made. I like the idea of interweaving vines, but I didn't want them jumbling the space up too much. So instead of yellow, I used off-white strips, and I think they're just right. Enough to be visible, but still lets the main vine stand out. I adore this dark blue color. The video does not do it justice. I didn't end up using it, but this is a good example of how I do curved strips which I wanted to show at least once because curved strips, they're a big part of this design. So that's getting close. Yeah, nicely done. And now we glue in a different color. Shades of the sea. That last strip is an off-white color, just kind of as a nod and a tie-in to the um, off-white strips of the vine. This is the flourish, which I always love to do. Just adds a little bit of um, added elegance to the design. I ended up loving this design so much. It's clean and simple, not too difficult, but really beautiful. And the colors really clinch it for me. Love that color combo. So I've got two close-ups for you, one straight on and then one at a slight angle to highlight the colors.
Thanks so much for watching.